So, we're at the 2021 Tanner Gun Show. At least I'm making my way in there. Uh, I guess you could say I'm filming this for one of my uh, subscribers. So, let's go ahead and get this done. Aid, this is for you. No. Hi. Hey. Yes. 16. All right, that's fine. How's your morning going so far? Oh, it's going all right. Right on. Here you go. Just a quick signature from you, please. All right. Would you like a stamp for re-entry as well? Sure. Okay. Can you see that underneath your ears, please? Thank you. All right. Thank you. Mm -hmm. All right. Let's see what we got here. What's up? We oftentimes say no cameras for this, just to, just for privacy. Not everyone has a phone, so we kind of backed off on it a little bit. But some folks won't be very comfortable with it being filmed. Okay. So we're trying to get permission. Okay. It's, okay. it's all good as long as the vendor's cool with it. Uh, no, this is this is like like I said, this is for a buddy of mine who lives out in England. He don't get the you know he don't get the privilege of seeing this stuff. Right. They're staying all is good. Just just know that some people won't. Go sure. Over. Sure. All right. Cool. Oh, we got MREs. That's not too terrible a price. Let's see, we've got quad rails. There are 15 uppers, oh shit, hell yeah. Think about it. Got a couple single actions. So, ball and cap. I gotta see if anybody's got a Beretta. Fourteen hundred dollars for that day. Spent only seven hundred on mine. CZ75. I'm not gonna lie, this would be a, this is actually a contender that I wouldn't mind buying. 
you guys have any Berettas by chance? Berettas? Yeah, I'm looking for an M9, uh, either an M9 or a 92 FS. I'm not sure This one is stamped. Yeah, those are 1911s. And this one has the British crown and tower marks. Oh, there's a Beretta. This one's pretty we'll much for one this of a one. kind of Civil War. It's That's 40, a new one. Wow. Okay. The green tags are new. The white ones are... Are used? Okay. Yeah. All right. Very cool. Magazine fed Remington 870. My only issue with magazine fed anything as far as the shotguns go is that magazines tend to deform uh, the shotgun shells. Ooh, got a coach gun. Stoger. Jesus Christ, they want $725 for these. I've seen these things brand spanking new for $500, so that's a lot of freaking money for side by side. Well, at least it's a 12 gauge. Looks like a vintage rubber training gun. Exactly what I call a good deal. Ooh. They may eight five five penetrators. Oh my god, Winchester. Oh man, that is a beautiful looking gun. Holy shit. What is this? Is this twenty gauge or twelve gauge? I think it's twelve. Yeah, twelve gauge. Freaking Winchester thirteen hundred. Look at that. Yeah. Is it Remington? Or? Yeah, Remington A70. Oh, how much do I want for this? Jeez, five fifty for that. How much do I want for the Winchester? 
525. Jesus Christ, I'm not like. Checked out the far side yet. Oh, got some AR 15 lower receivers. Best deal. Completed. That's about right up to my speed right there. Palmetto State Arms. Shit, man. Be close. Yeah, he came over. He came by this morning and looked at it. Yeah. Another yeah. poverty pony. Yeah, they said so, but I was like, let me go check just to make it easy. You know what? I mean, think about it. If you're looking at it, you're looking at it. Hey, man, if I was looking at that, you're going to go get full shit. I just know you Yeah, so I just. It, to me, it is what it is. Let me know if you have any questions. I was just wondering if you got any. I would like to do an, an AR-15 build that's as close to what I'm going to get to a civilian compliant M16. Do you have any that uh, upper receivers that have like a barrel length greater than 16 inches with a A2 style front sight? Those. I can't get uh, the ones with uh, the carry handle right now. Yeah, no, that's that's fine if I can't get a carry handle. I'm just looking for the A2 front sight, and then I can just always put an A4 uh, carry handle okay. sight on the rear. No, the only ones I have will be for 16 inch. Yeah, that seems to be the. That's all I can find is the 16. I'm trying to find something with you know like, I think the M16 had 18 inches or greater. I don't remember. Yeah, well, 20. Is it 20 inch? Yeah. So this is the same lower that we have with that. Yeah. Kind of yeah, yeah, yeah. I could do less than 300. It's like, we got three of them later. Okay. Well, I'll come back and look. Uh, this is just kind of a secondary thing. Like I said, I'm looking to do another AR build. If that's still there. I might look at buying it. Thank you. Got scopes. Oh, these are those uh, laser training, uh, those laser training uh, snap, well, I call them snap caps, or not snap caps, but laser training dummy rounds. I wonder how much I want for all this. I've got three guys come up to me already, so. Okay. He, he probably has, gonna put an idea at this point on it. 